ब्रेन ट्यूमर की सबसे आधुनिक सर्जरी जिसमें ना दर्द है ना है ज्यादा खर्च इस सर्जरी की खास बात यह है कि मरीज अपने पैरों से चलकर आता है और पैरों से चलकर जाता है तो महज तीस मिनट में ब्रेन ट्यूमर का इलाज अब संभव है ऐसा एक ऐसी अत्याधुनिक तकनीक मुमकिन हुआ है जिसे पूरे दक्षिण एशिया में पहली बार भारत में अपोलो हॉस्पिटल ने लॉन्च किया है तीस मिनट के सत्र में मरीज को इस प्रक्रिया के तहत न कोई दर्द होगा और न कोई किसी तरह का दुष्प्रभाव होने वाला है जेपैक्स नामक यह तकनीक सीधे तौर पर ट्यूमर को तोड़ने का काम करती है। तो ये है जेपैक्स रेडियो सर्जरी जिसमें खर्च बहुत कम खर्चे में है आपकी सर्जरी हो जाती है जैसे नॉर्मल खर्च आता है इस तरह के खर्चे में ये आपकी सर्जरी हो जाती है तो ये जेपैक्स तकनीक ब्रेन ट्यूमर के इलाज में एक नए युग की शुरुआत कर रही है यह मरीजों को केवल तीस मिनट तक चलने वाले सत्र के साथ गैर आक्रामक दर्द मुक्त मुक्त विकल्प प्रदान करता है यह बताना भी जरूरी है कि आमतौर पर ट्यूमर का ऑपरेशन करीब तीन से चार घंटे तक चलता है जबकि जेपैक्स तकनीक तीस मिनट के अंदर एक सत्र में उपचार कर देती है एक दिन में उपचार और घर के मरीज के घर वापसी भी संभव है अपोलो हॉस्पिटल के ग्रुप के संस्थापक अध्यक्ष डॉक्टर प्रताप रेड्डी ने इसे लॉन्च किया और कहा कि चार दशकों से अधिक समय से अपोलो हॉस्पिटल स्वास्थ्य सेवा के क्षेत्र में आगे बढ़ रहा है जेपैक्स उन्नत सुरक्षा प्रोटोकॉल के साथ आता है जिसमें तत्काल त्रिटी का पता लगाना और विकिरण रिशाव को कम करना संभव है यह उपचार के बाद रोगी की भलाई और जीवन की गुणवत्ता सुनिश्चित करता है इसके अलावा ओपीडी में भी यह संभव होगी जिसमें रोगियों को काफी आसानी मिलेगी तो फ्रेंड्स ब्रेन ट्यूमर का 30 मिनट मिनट में इलाज कैसे संभव है आइए चल के बात करते हैं डॉक्टर से जो कि वो बताने वाले हैं कि 30 मिनट में कैसे इलाज संभव है तो हमारे साथ हैं डॉक्टर साहब तो चलिए बात करते हैं इनसे कि किस तरह से 30 मिनट में इलाज संभव है सर 30 मिनट में कैसे संभव है सर्जरी है ये डिपेंड करता है कि साइज कितना बड़ा है ट्यूमर का जी। अगर ट्यूमर का साइज रेडिएशन थर्टी मिनट हम कंप्लीट कर सकते हैं डीप में ऐसे काफ़ी सारे ट्यूमर्स होते हैं डीप सिटी स्मॉल ट्यूमर्स होते हैं बिलाइन ट्यूमर्स होते हैं स्मॉल मेडिकल ट्यूमर्स होते हैं उनका आप थर्टी टू फोर्टी फाइव मिनट्स में ट्रीट कर सकते हैं कितना रिस्की रहेगा ये नहीं एज सच कोई जो सर्जी के रिस्क होते हैं ओपन सर्जी के जब आप अंदर जाते हैं लेजर के द्वारा होगा ये रेडिएशन के द्वारा जी थैंक यू हाई एनर्जी रेडिएशन विच इज वेरी फोकस जी जी और खर्च कितना बैठेगा नॉर्मल सर्जरी में होता है जी थैंक यू Can access to it to have cost effective. This is why in everything that we have done from day one, when it started with heart surgery, it started with everything that happening in in medicine and surgery. But it was cost effective treatment that made us so that so many people, you know, over a million people had access to a borrow because of our cost effective. So this is going to be around five lakhs of rupees, uh, but this is the minimum. Uh, uh, as I said, it is in tune with our vision to make it cost effective, so that more and more people can have an access to this. Describe the sunlight. So it's a, there is a energy and effect from sunlight, but it takes many many days and weeks even or Or even hours and hours and hours of exposure to sort of get a, any effect, and oftentimes the effect is rather muted. It's kind of limited. The ZAPX, by concentrating the radiation very intensely, really in order of magnitude more intensely than you're doing with radio therapy, allows a much more potent effect. And so, in the net result is a surgical-like outcome. It's almost like cutting the tissue, but with Cutting the tissue with radiation. Now, I don't think or Apollo Delhi is going to treat all million patients in India, but there are opportunities, I think, to fix that problem in and elsewhere.
experience as Frita has said, but uh, patients from 147 countries now come to India for healthcare because of the clinical outcomes that we offer. Part of this journey was when we first started Apollo. I mean, we were mending hearts, we were fixing broken hearts, we started that way, and we continue to do that. So while we've improved life expectancy, a significant part of that journey that Chairman is very passionate about is preventive health. We would travel overseas to practice. We stopped before. Infant mortality has decreased by a factor of six. 80% of the patients who come to places like Apollo and other corporate hospitals used to go abroad for treatment. Treat and save lives and countless number of patients using the new technology that we're talking about today, the ZAPX. So it, for me, this has been a long journey. Um, I, as a young man coming out of actually Mass General, I spent a year at the Karolinska Institute in Sweden, where the founder of radio surgery, a great man named Lars Luxell, I fell under his spell. He was creating not just a new way of treating cancer, treating tumors, but he was thinking about very much about the future of surgery. Forever, when people think about surgery, they think of pain, they think of disability, they think of anesthesia, big, expensive, long, drawn-out procedures, and oftentimes best investments, and I would like to thank all of you for being part of this. Apollo has consistently been doing this over the past 40 years. I think when we first laid the brick for the first Apollo hospital in Chennai, that itself was a milestone because it brought a new way of doing things, a new way of uh, delivering health care to our countrymen. Uh, at that point, I think that which represents a significant advancement beyond other technologies that are available now. The upcoming scientific congress for the launch of ZAPEX will be attended by illustrious Professor John Heller from the USA and Professor Max Mangroge from Germany, who have already treated these patients and are very happy with, with, with the results that they are obtaining in their pain for their patients. And I invite each of you to honor the state of our medical equipment to deliver the best possible care for each of your patients and make this world a healthier and happier one. I think this technology will make India lead the path in healthcare for the world and together we will do it. Because for us, every life is precious. Zapex is pain-free, non-invasive, safe and requires no anesthesia. That's not all. Zapex does not need an overnight hospital stay or incisions. Zapex treatment entails 30 minute sessions. From hours of surgery, we have now progressed to 30 minute sessions, transforming delivery of care and improving quality of life like never before. Reduced radiation to healthy tissues ensures a quicker recovery, allowing patients to heal faster. From consultation to post treatment, we have reimagined care to deliver an unmatched experience every step of the way. We at the Universal Apollo Hospital are revolutionizing neuroradio surgery with ZAPEX. Trust the Apollo and ZAP for innovation, precision, and excellence in surgical outcomes. As a neurosurgeon, precision is paramount in treating brain tumors and other neurological conditions. That's why I trust ZAPEX, the cutting edge solution for stereotactic radio surgery. Sort of projected that about 300,000 people are diagnosed uh, with primary brain or spinal cord tumors. But again, these numbers uh, need to be taken with a pinch of salt because of underreporting. Up to now, brain surgery was the chosen modality to address the rising tide of brain tumor cases. But today, we mark a new paradigm uh, which will shift the way in which cancer care is, is given for every Indian, for every person in this region, and of course from the world over. This afternoon, we're announcing the launch of the ZAPEX gyroscopic radio surgery, which opens up new frontiers in modern surgical robotics for brain tumors and other conditions as well, which were previously considered unconceivable. To give more insights onto this revolutionary technology, we have a short aim to apprise you of what this technology actually does. To go up from 14.6 lakh cases in 2022, to 15.7 lakh cases just next year in 2025. 
according to the ICMR. And within that, brain tumors, the rate of new cases of brain and nervous system cancers was 6.2% per 100,000 for men and women per year, and the death rate is 4.4. So it, is, it has massive mortality and morbidity effects. And brain tumors constitute about 80 to 90 percent of all CNS or central nervous system. And thanks to senior clinicians, colleagues, friends, everybody uh, who is in this packed hall here today. Some housekeeping wishes for both uh, to you as well. This event marks a new chapter in the country's fight against the scourge of cancer, which we have seen increasing rapidly in the past decade or so. But before I get to the subject of the day, I must extend a very warm welcome to our founder chairman. तो फ्रेंड्स कैसी लगी ये जानकारी हमें कमेंट करके जरूर बताइएगा आप भी ऐसी कोई जानकारी हम तक पहुंचाने का चाहते हैं तो हमें कमेंट बॉक्स में कमेंट कर सकते हैं अपना नंबर छोड़ सकते हैं मिलते हैं नेक्स्ट वीडियो में बाय